Hi, I'm Joyce, the Energy Lady. I have something kind of cool to share with you today. I am a flower person. I love flowers. And I have a special connection with the lotus flowers. And maybe I fell in love with them when I was in China. I don't know. Because there were a lot of lily ponds and they had a lot of lotus flowers everywhere. And so um, in my office, I have some cool lotus representation of lotus flowers. But on Instagram, I got kind of, I'm a sucker for some things there. And I saw that they had lotus flower seeds for sale. So I bought them. I brought them home. I want to show you what they look like. They're like this hard shell. Little, it's like the size of a bean, a little bigger. Anyway, and um, when I first saw this, I thought, how's that going to be? <laughs> how's that really going to grow? And it says to just put it in a bowl of water. Okay, so um, I've been watching it, trying to figure out, is this going to go somewhere? Is this really going to do something? So it's been in that bowl of water for about five days. And I noticed this morning, sprouts. Is that cool? It started sprouting. And then one of those even got bigger today. Just this much sprouting today. So you're wondering why am I sharing this with you? But, but for me... I kind of experience this as, are we patient with ourselves when we're trying to grow? For me, when I was looking at that seed, I said, okay, now it's been in that bowl of water for six days. Why isn't it doing anything? And then all of a sudden this morning, I saw it open a little bit with a little bit of sprout. And then by the end of the day today, it's the full, like this much sprout on it. Who knows what it's going to be tomorrow? I'm pretty excited to see. But are you patient with yourself when you're going through a growth spurt? When you're experiencing something that might be painful, that um, maybe you're uh, actually even experiencing some grief in some way? Are you allowing yourself or giving yourself permission to go through the steps or the process of grief. I say grief because anytime we experience anything painful, we're going to go through steps of grief because we don't know how to deal with pain. There's just no other way. And so are you giving yourself permission and allowing yourself to, and be gentle on yourself to go through what you need to in order to grow? Because every painful experience we have, we can make it just what it is. This is a painful experience, or we can make up stories about it. We can find someone to blame. We could regret. We might have um, things that we are beating ourselves up over or um, not being really happy about it, the things you're saying about it. So, so look at any painful experience you have as a growth experience, even though it's hard to say in the moment. That is exactly what it's there for. It is there for you to grow from. I don't know how painful it was for these seeds to sit in water for six days, but for me, it was painful to watch because I wanted it to do something now. And that's exactly how I see life when painful things happen. It's like, how, how fast will this pain go away? How long do I have to deal with this pain? We do live in a society, in a world today of automatic um, gratification or Pain relief is so, so accessible. And so we don't always give ourselves the time we need to have the growth we need to get from that pain experience because we want to get rid of it as fast as we can. So look at whatever it is you're in the middle of. If you're experiencing some pain around something, if you're experiencing something that you're not liking and you're wanting it to go away right away, what are you learning from it? What is the experience you're having of learning? And allow yourself to go through that. Give yourself permission. Be gentle on yourself. Care, be careful with you because you are learning. You're a little seed that's just learning and sprouting and growing. I will share with you throughout this whole growth experience with my seeds because it's so fascinating to me. I've never grown lotus flowers. So um, anyway, share with me if you would. I would love to hear from you growth experiences that you're having right now. It might be something painful. It literally might be something that you don't want to go through and you just want that pain to go away. I do have ways to help people 
Sometimes it's a one-time session. Sometimes it's multiple sessions. But I do help people to deal with pain. So book a consult with me today and let's talk. Have a good day.